What's going on YouTube? Geosno right here. Today we're discussing about jailbreaking iOS 18. Yes, the very first jailbreak for iOS 18 is now available. It only supports a bunch of devices, but it is the first jailbreak for iOS 18 and you can download it today and use it. We're going to get into that in a second. This video is brought to you by Tenor Share Rayboot, a software that allows you to fix your iOS system if it's broken, showing errors, and you can easily downgrade and upgrade with this tool. If you want to downgrade from the latest iOS 18 beta, you can easily do so with this tool. Definitely check the program out in the link below. So the Pelerine jailbreak has received a massive overhaul. The website has been changed, there is a brand new version available, support for iOS 18 beta has been added for the supported devices. So you press download over here to get it and you go here, select your device and as you can see it does support Mac OS, it supports Linux and for other types of PC, for example Windows, sadly there's no version available at the moment. However, you could actually use something like Live Linux USB in order to use it on your computer and that doesn't require you to replace your Windows. However, it's important to note that a brand new version has been released and this one is the version 2.0. It was released two weeks ago, it flew a little bit under the radar for me, so bear with me on that. But yes, it is indeed the first iPadOS 18 supported jailbreak. So you can see that it says in here on the highlighted changes, iPadOS 18 support. You can see in here that it says this only supports iPads that have got an iOS 18. And due to this being extremely new, some aspects when jailbreaking are gonna be broken. For example, the settings application has been rewritten on iOS 18 and preference loader will need to be updated to work. That's a tweak that allows you to change settings for other tweaks in the settings application. Additionally, LKit safe mode UI's red top bar is not currently working. iPadOS 17.6 and potentially higher 17 versions are supported. Apple TV support for tvOS 15.0 and above, shipping Procursus Bootstrap and stuff like that. It does have a few fixes as well and some improvements on the speed and whatever, but the most important part is that you now have the option to jailbreak iPadOS 18, aka iOS 18, and you will be able to have tweaks. There are some things that are still broken, but the jailbreak is there and once you install it, you should be able to install at least some of the tweaks. So Pelrain is indeed a very massive jailbreak. It's unfortunate that it doesn't support newer iPhone models, but you still can get iOS 18 jailbroken on very specific iPads. Thank you for watching. I am Geo Snow. Till the next time, subscribe to stay updated and peace out.